Hey guys, this is a video of the time we went to the Medieval Torture Museum in Hollywood. And just a pre-warning here, this is not for the faint at heart. Missy, Marley, Vanessa, and myself got a sneak preview a month before their grand opening. And needless to say, it was not disappointing and really eye-opening to some of the torture devices that were thought of and created back in the day. So I hope you enjoy this. This one right over here is scolding of the heel. Oh, oh my no. God. So they would just go ahead, of course, that's not the cold. Just press it right up here, and it can be either oil or anything oh like that. And a match is being scolded all the way. Oh, of course. Gosh. How'd you do it? Just this part? Yeah. Oh my God, look at my shoe. Wow. What? Wow. And, wow. Wow. and of course, our really definition is very good. Right. My heel is burning. The oh, burn, right? that, Yeah. Um, so, but just imagine, whatever the punishment may be, it's always something different. It's never the same. And again, there's no discrimination. It's not like, oh, because you're a woman, yeah, we're yeah, going to yeah, do yeah. less on you. No, it is Everybody pure. got it. Yeah, everybody got it. Dang. Whoever did this, amazing. Thank you. <laughs> I made this. Because I'm like, she burned. He's like, this is her <laughs> Her feet is cool. I was born one <laughs> Just straight off and hostile movies. Your like. back is right here. So it's already oh been pierced. God. So of course oh they're God. stretching you out it's farther. Pierced. And then as your skin has already oh. been pierced and your body's stretching, oh it moves oh all God. the way. So basically it's just a needle just stretching oh you out. And then as it rolls, then another one pierces inside. My brain you. is just like this is crazy. It's so cool. <laughs> What's mm. It's so cool. It's so fucked. <laughs> Strapado? Mm -hmm. I like that. Strapado. They actually had fancy names. I know, know I'm but getting then of so course inspired. it just progressed for something else after a while. I didn't have that name. You know, like say from the cord to the rack. Oh, look, there's a photo. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, I don't think. Oh, man. Right. So the night. when this is being used, and again, you know, this is. I'm not saying um, this is a replica, it's not an actual, it was an actual use or anything like that, but this is what they actually had back then. And when you actually hear, which you all gonna wanna come around, oh when you hear the voice of like that, because you, know, you think it's the bull, it's not only that, it's because Whoa. you're being burned alive. So no matter where you touch what? this bull, okay. fire's coming in, and you're burning. And so the reason why they made it this big, Can not- Can I have you open the hatch Of course. Oh my God. <laughs> I wasn't ready for that. That was so dramatic. You're actually burning. Oh yeah. And here you go. Now the reason why they made it actually this size and this big, <laughs> is because they actually want to put multiple people in there, not just one. That's crazy. Wow, wow, wow. Wait, can I get the little name? No. I didn't think you guys were that messed up. Okay, wait, let me get, let me get a good angle. <laughs> so, from what I've known about this one right here is the actual electric chair. Uh, about more than 400 people died in this chair. So, so you acquired this then? Yeah. Electrica. 400 these, people. These product names. You know. It's like Ikea, but way better. Yes. <laughs> you know. mm -hmm. you so you basically, you're, you're pinned. So right over here, in this Don't middle part right here, there. there's um, little spikes that gets into your um, toes <gasps> right over here. But you know, as you know, as you as a woman moves her heels and everything like that, it moves up. There's spikes right over here that digs into you once you actually go upwards like that. So. <laughs> so back then, of course, now, I mean, the, the rope just broke not that long ago. But imagine you're actually lying down here <gasps> and slicing your body. Now, actually, oh. as you can see, it actually sliced right over here. But you're slicing, being sliced oh, slowly. Yeah. So, no know touch. <laughs> oh, we can't. Oh. That was so perfect. No, That's but you so have perfect. to hear the sound bit that goes with it. You ready for it? Let me flip it. I'm gonna go right, maybe here. Oh, 
I love that. That is <laughs> iconic. <laughs> iconic. Now with her, uh, you have to you have to use your imagination. This is actually being hung really high, where nobody could actually um, give her food. So basically, you are starvation. Um, you're starving yourself to death, and that was your punishment. But what punishment that may be, it's been, it varies. But you're hung somewhere real high, and basically you withered, and that's how you're gonna actually look when you actually die. So if you need to use the restroom or whatever the case may be, you just go. His, of course, of course are you talking brilliant. about the Vladi Impaler? Yeah, so Vladi Impaler, yeah, of course. Um, basically, this is his stuff. So what happened, of course, the stocks right in here, these are miniaturized. These are not the original ones. But anybody that was original, if you were caught and you're the enemy, either you're alive or almost dead, what they're gonna go ahead and do, they're gonna go ahead and he shoves this through the heart. No. no. <laughs> through the rear. Oh! oh my. Then my butt just he lifts his shoe. <laughs> And, and basically, your body slowly goes down, and that's the impairment. And that's what happens to these guys, right? Oh now. my god. So, but remember, god. it's either he'll stick it straight to your back or right up there. Through your asshole? Yeah. What the fuck? That's why he's remembered it. Yeah. Yeah. I went to. Um, See, the sharp edges, well, it's no longer sharp, but basically, I, I, again, replica, not authentic. You know, they'll put your head right over here. Oh! Chop it up. No! It's not, of course, it's not going to be fully cut off. So that's when they're going to go ahead and use this. Oh my god! To, yep. Oh my god! And that wow. was made of wood. Yes. So the chopping off. I pick it? I want to hear I wood. Can yes. Of course. <laughs> that was. But then, not again, easy remember. Easy no, but then again, as time goes on. From place to place, they advanced it. I did. That's what I get for twerking at a torture museum. So this one right actually here, of course, you know, fire pit and everything like that is gonna be boiling water and everything like that. But they actually put family members here, so like the father and son, and push them down. If you're trying to escape, they'll go hit them and just get sticks and just keep on pushing them down. Oh So my that's God. another form of punishment as well. Too. And again, it depends on the error and like the time and the what. It's crazy. <laughs> To watch your children try no, like, to... No, you, you, like say, the father and son are going through, yeah. No, I know, but like you going through the torture but while watching your son also and getting pushed up. Mm -hmm. And exactly. not be able to do anything because exactly. you're in there too. Exactly, so I actually have my small little definition right there as well too, so y'all can go and take a look at it, take a picture of it. This right here? Yes, ma'am. Did oh, you really? do a lot? Is that your work? Like you wrote? No, 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 no. So oh, okay. it, it's been passed down to me. So I just, you know, I need the knowledge of it. So yeah. I just, you know, again, the pamphlets are right there. But that's why I want the audio. So people this was an ancient Egypt. I'm not always going to be doing the tours or anything like that. I'm only doing this because, you know, it's a private Punish signature. disobedience to the Pharaoh. Genghis Khan executed his enemies and his band. Get my photo. <laughs> I'm scared. What's in there? Oh Jesus. my fucking god! A treasure trove of dead bodies. <laughs> Chest with body parts. Mm -hmm. So, of course, I just showed you a video, but this is what happens. They're gonna actually get this one right, right over here to go ahead and break all your fingers right there. Oh, oh my gosh. gosh. Is that anything? Yeah, it's an example right here. This one to cut off your fingers right there. And of course, they hammer and nail through it. Holy Or Jesus. just break your fingers, you know, piece by piece. Oh my gosh, you know, like when you, your nail will like break off and take your nail with it, and mm. it's like, mm. you're Actual. done for the whole week. You're like, not until it heals, I'm not. Oh my god, I just saw this guy. His hands. And he has tears in his eyes. I need so, to of course, this. guillotine. Now, the blade is real, but of course the stock is definitely you know, a replica because we, you know, the real ones were actually a lot higher. Yeah, so y'all have it on video right now? Yeah. Oh, no, hold on. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. I'm ready. ready. You're all ready. Higher and coming down, so 
people will also have two ways of being, uh, being their head chopped off. Either by looking at the blade going in, or you're facing down where you just don't know when it's going to happen. It's definitely not when you know it's coming. Well, at least it was fast. <laughs> not like the first one. Wow. Oh my god. I oh, cannot wow. believe. Mm -hmm. Yeah, if I was going to go death by decapitation, I'd take this one over the other oh, one. Any quick death for me, no boiling oh, me, yeah. no peeling my skin off, mm -hmm. no thank you. I will just take a quick decapitation, Although they send it on my way. You can still see and process things for like five seconds, five or ten right. seconds. That's what oh. they say. But, but they no, can't prove it. No, right? they can't prove it. Nobody knows. <laughs> but your body was to have some kind of spasm. That's what I was gonna say, I bet your body still has yeah, a twitch. Because remember, yeah, so you're just twitching and everything I like would that. Hope it takes like two this. seconds for <laughs> just twitch doing that. Unfortunately, there's no real <laughs> control. Can't control it. You know, I'm considered tiny compared to back then. When you talk about the Vikings or the Romans, you know, just they were bigger okay. and bigger in size, more warrior-like, same thing like with women. Especially like in Ireland and Scotland, you know, you have your women that's gonna fight with their man with the swords. Now, back then, the swords were extremely bigger. Like, have you ever seen a um, Game of Thrones? How yeah, that big my sword? Favorite show. Yeah, those were big. And I actually have a few of them back here. Mm -hmm. And again, you know, those were the actual size. Wow. You know, what was this for? Dude. It's either to go ahead and you know pierce her, you know pierce her head right <gasps> over here and then squeeze in it, Mark, or again it could be anywhere like body. from your neck to your body. Oh my fucking god! Mm -hmm. Yes, it keeps going. Some more. It elements. keeps giving. Oh, oh, these skulls in the wall. They're like wow. Then it's kind of going. Wow. I feel like we're oh. underground. I do too. I feel like we're so far underground. <laughs> Whoa. I am the comfortable one. So with that one right there, the think, of it, think of it as a pyramid piercing your back. Wow. Now if you actually look to the diagram on your left side, that's also going through up the anal cavity. No, no, on inside the cage. Oh, inside? Yeah. You could actually see, you know, <gasps> like weights putting down oh, and going inside here. Oh. I do yeah. too. Yeah. It's very pleasing. It sets the mood. I should not sound aroused when I say that. Like the crater uh, of Judah. This is insane. Mm -hmm. This is insanity. What is up with that little devil guy on the wall? It's just <laughs> aesthetically. I just liked it. <laughs> it's a masky board while he's on it. <laughs> I know when I said it, well, when my my buyer started buying all these masks. I'm like, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, these are all like um, auctioned and everything like that. So I'm like, I just want to hear. That's fun. That's crazy. That's crazy. How do you like do like what? I just what can the you do is to deserve to deserve this? Like <laughs> again, dip. No, when it comes to. Different time error. I know, right? Yeah, it, like, it just really was unacceptable. Yeah, you know. Yo, look at me wrong. Get in the wheel, man. Oh my god. <laughs> you know, like if you, you if you finish your trash out. Well, like this one, if we all went back into time right now, I would you know, be. it's like the hands made tale again. It was modern day, and then they took them back into an era that they all didn't understand, where people yeah. were like, wait, we're all treated equal here, but they're like, no, no, mm -hmm. not anymore. Not anymore. And again, so, back then it wasn't about you... race, it's, it's, you know, it's, I say this, uh, it's all about the discrimination of if you think that you're doing bad or good, or whatever the case may be, you're still, you're still going to be punished. Because it was totally different, there was no rights, if, like, either you're a peasant or you're just royal. Or yeah, there's just yeah. and so just, back then the church had more of a say yeah. than then of course the king, but then the, the church will tell no, this is the way you need to do it. And then of course the king was like, Oh, I wanna be in his good gracious. So. Game of Thrones. Yeah. <laughs> That's what I was gonna ask. I'm like it was like it was like a godly righteous movement. Where yeah. It was like there's only one right way, one right answer. Yeah. It had faux leather, so it was cushiony, mm -hmm. but it still did the job, you know, it still caused a bit of pain. Wait, what is this? Well, you see how she's sitting? You can have them sitting this way, or you can have their head down here, 
and their bottom here so their whole torso is like on this and so the way her ankles are tied they would be tied down this way and her wrists would be tied as well so it pulls her whole body down and forces to sort of slowly be impaled but why do I sound like the doses? <laughs> Look at this big one. Look at this big one. You're like, look at this one. Oh, is this It's like a reverse bear trap. Buster. Missy, this is like the bra you have <laughs> that holds your boobs. <laughs> Little swings. Where you shove it up into your cooter, uh -huh. and it looks like a, like a condom, um, and it had spikes in it, so it doesn't hurt you because they're facing in. So, but if somebody tried, tried to, to rape you, they get a. Have you guys seen The Feast? No. The horror movie, The Feast. Yeah, I have. Yes. Where they, Tell the, me about it. The, a guy, like a rich dude, breaks a wine glass. The girl who's there to help for the night they were like clean up that glass in the driveway and whatever she takes a piece of the glass she puts it in her you know what does her services throughout the rest of the night but then to get back at the family one of the brothers goes into the woods to have sex with him and he as soon as he puts his which i don't understand how it doesn't cut her because it is a piece of glass and i give her all the rounds of applause for that however but yeah. It gets him. Yeah, it literally. I know. <laughs> There's one way. <laughs> Welcome to our domain. We don't have drinks, so shit out of luck. All right, Missy. So so far, what you've seen in this museum, what do you think so far? Like, what do you think of this place opening up in about a month? I am so impressed and inspired by everything I've seen so far. I love seeing all the different devices and hearing the different backgrounds of you know how these devices came to be because I already knew a lot of the names and like functions of a lot of these pieces, but I love hearing the details of it, like the history behind it. But as a dominatrix, I am of course inspired by a lot of these new pieces, so I'm definitely going to be adding some custom new furniture pieces to my dungeon. So thank you for having us. I'm so inspired. I didn't know there was so many different, I knew about the guillotine, I knew about like burning at the stake, but there are some things, and I'm like a nerd for like medieval stuff. So I had no idea that like there were so many different torture devices. And it's just so, interesting to see how these are mostly like lower class people and poor people that are getting like tortured and things like that and also like the woman too how like it was only men doing the torture and it was mostly the women like which is burning at the stake and stuff like that so this is all so interesting i feel like i've learned a lot and i'm also inspired by like the names because you know i own a makeup business so i'm like what names can i use that are not too crazy and my actually my newest blush palette is inspired by like romeo and juliet and it's kind of like medieval too so i feel like i feel very inspired inspired to be here so i'm very grateful that we got invited to see this before anybody else um, this is super bitchin' number one. I think it's fantastic. I've never really seen anything like it. I had the pleasure of visiting Budapest like years ago and we got to see um, Vlad the Impaler's underground lair and it was pretty freaking cool. So there was a lot of things that told some more history on that here, which I love. Um, who doesn't love a good story about Dracula? But um, I also find it so damn fascinating or interesting that a lot of, um, I think a lot of horror movies honestly take inspiration from a lot of this shit, to be honest. So I'm like full Saw vibes in here and the movie Hostel, like, you know what I mean? So I'm just like, oh, they use that. They use this. So I took away from a lot of that and of course appreciating the history aspects of it. So cool finding a lot of the stuff out that you had no idea. I mean, there is a barrel behind us that bugs go into and you put a person in there and the bugs eat the person. That's just great. It's great. <laughs> okay, I'm done. Okay.